Okay, guys. Look at this picture. Tell me what you see. You see a hilltop. You see another small hilltop. You see a couple of radio masts. And a cute little tower. We can all agree on this, right? Okay. Okay, well, as much as I love all the surface level experiments that people do and uh, the wacky excuses that flat earthers give as to why boats magically disappear from the bottom up, even though there is a little bit of reflection going on at the bottom, but you don't acknowledge the fact that the rest of the boat disappears, I would love to get in on that action, but the problem is, is that, well, I'm in Germany right now. I don't exactly have a bunch of large bodies of water within, well, within reasonable driving distance that I could use. So, I had to come up with something else, and guess what? I did. Now, while filming another experiment that I'm working on, which will be available soon, which includes this guy, stumbled across another little idea, which one of my boys came up with, and it's quite simple. If you are looking from an elevated location to another elevated location, if the earth was flat, Everything that is lower than those two elevations should never get in the way of it. The low point will never obstruct the view between the two high points. It just never will. Geometrically, it will never, it'll never happen. And it'll especially never happen if the claim of the horizon always meets the eye level is possible. So, here I am. I'm standing up on a place called Schwanberg which is just outside Ipphofen, Germany. Now the direction I'm looking, I'm looking at the area of Würzburg. On the west side of Würzburg, there is a, a farm of antenna masts and right next to it, a very old lookout tower called the Frankenwart. Now beyond this tower, along this line of sight, there are a bunch of very large hills and these hills are higher than the tower. And Schwanberg is higher than the tower. So there should be absolutely no reason why I can't see these mountains above Frankenwart Tower. There should be absolutely no reason if the earth was flat and the horizon always rises to eye level. Geometrically, logically, and even common sense wise, there is absolutely no reason why I should not be able to see the tops of those mountains. If the earth was flat, absolutely no reason. The truth of the matter is, is that the distance from where I'm standing to the location of those mountain tops is about a half a degree, a little bit more than a half a degree of the earth's surface, which basically means there's curvature involved. Now, if you do the calculations, there should be quite a few meters of obstruction, which coincides with the footage that I filmed.
I look forward to your responses. Vanishing point and all this other stuff. Well, vanishing point doesn't really exactly work. If you guys sit, sit here and talk about you can see lighthouses from 100 miles away. Vanishing point doesn't seem to work if it takes the sun several thousand miles before it disappears, or the moon for that matter. There is no other explanation except for a curved surface. Because according to simple geometry, line of sight, and the horizon always raising to eye level, these two heights, you should see that whole hill range above the entire hill where that tower is on top of. Y'all have a nice day.